Hi everyone and welcome to another video. This is Hello to Spain and today I'm going to show you a fabulous villa located on the Saya Golf Resort. So we'll start out here. I'll show you this is the parking, gated parking for the villa. Let's go and have a look at the garden. The plot is around the 1200 square meters. We've got a few steps. We've got stunning views, um, panoramic views of the area, not just the sea that you can see in the background, but the golf course, the valley, the mango mountain. Okay, so this is the main level. We've got pretty Nile. Ideal place to just sit out with a book. Enjoy a bit of sun. It's actually fairly quiet. Okay, so this is the main entrance into the villa. We have a light lounge with barreled ceiling, also fans and lighting. There's also a fireplace with an inset wood burner. The villa has got central heating, gas central heating. So the radiators you'll see, that's for the central heat in there. This is the kitchen. Got electric hob oven, breakfast bar on this side. We've got the sink. Good size. And even the space for the breakfast table. We've got here at the spire staircase going down to the lower level can be accessed um, from the side of the property because there's, there's another staircase. Look at those views. Stunning. So here we have a glazed in Naya that's used as the dining room and also a sit-in room as you can see. This room is pretty much to enjoy the views. So we can see the golf course here. Mongo Mountain Natural Park. Got panoramic views. Okay, let's go on. So back into the lounge. We have an archway leading to this room, which currently is used as another dining room but it could be easily used as another bedroom. In fact, I think previous owner actually used it as a bedroom. Okay, we've got another beautiful archway. And then we've got bedroom number two. We've got also the ceiling fan and lighting. Window, built in wardrobes. Then we have from the shower room, also with a window, and this is the master bedroom. And so it's bathroom, bath with shower over. And bedrooms good size bedroom with ceiling fine and lighting let's go and have a look at the views again we also have the built-in wardrobes covered over 
and doors, double opening doors into glazed in eye as well. Okay, let's go and have a look at the pool and then we'll go to the lower level to have a look at it. We have another bedroom, bathroom and utility room that can be converted into a kitchen as well. Plenty of garden and fairly easy maintenance as this doesn't need a lot of watering. So we've got here the swimming pool. Pool side is big enough for, as you can see, sand loungers. It's an outdoor shower there. And just next to the pool, we've got this room. The moment they use it for the garden furniture and a few bits and pieces, but this could be perfect as a an outdoor kitchen or summer lounge. Because in summer you'll need a bit of shade. So we've got a bit more of a garden here. Well, let's go and have a look at the rest of the accommodation downstairs. So we've got, um, as I said, a separate entrance from the side of the property and in. This is used as a, at the moment as an office here. And we've got an archway, two archway, into like the open plan lounge dining room. This down here could be perfectly um, another apartment, separate apartment for guests and family. So that's um, you. We've got a ceiling fan and lighting window that overlooks the swimming pool. We've got staircase going up to the main villa. And we've got plenty of wardrobes. And then behind that door, there's a really big uh, storeroom. It goes from pretty much this wall here to the end there where the TV is. And it extends at the back as well, so it's really big ideal for storage and then here we've got the utility room and a spare fridge as well so as you can see it all really looks like a kitchen it's used only as um, a utility room but this you can make it into uh, a self-contained apartment and here we've got another good size bedroom From this window, you can see golf course, mountains, and um, the sea. This room has also a door that takes you out to the surface, and we also have another bathroom, a shower. And window outside. Okay, so let's have a look at the other side of the property where we've got more garden. So the plot. That is actually part of the property as well. There's a few terraces there. Another storeroom. Pretty much for garden tools. And then it continues this way. So we've got some steps there. 
to this side of the property. And again, some other terraces. Space for sitting outside, a bit of a garden. And again, to enjoy the views. So thank you for watching. And if you want to have a look at this property, you can check on our website, hello to Spain.com. Thank you.